All right, there's a video showing you how to sign up for Khan Academy, enroll in my class, and then change your name. So first thing you want to do is go to Khan Academy. You can just search for Khan Academy and bring it up. Um, and you come to this main screen here. Uh, you're going to click either Start Learning Now or Log In. They take you to the same place. I always sign in with my Gmail. Now you could sign in with Facebook or you could sign up with any email. Um, I like having just one Google account that gets me into all my favorite websites. Um, and then you're going to pick whichever user you're signing in with. I made up a new one that's just student with my last name at Gmail. It takes a minute or two to make up. There's fake student for you. It takes just a minute to make a Gmail account. <clears throat> Okay, so I just sign in with my normal Gmail usually. The only reason I'm not doing that is because then it would load as a teacher, and so the screen would be different. I wanted to show you what it looks like to sign in for the first time. So signing in for the first time, it makes you choose an avatar. You can choose whichever picture you want. As you earn points, you will unlock many, many more. Uh, but to start, let's just choose any image. Click Save. Okay, now the first thing it asks you to do is pick a subject. So under math, you're going to select Algebra 1. Uh, it very closely covers what um, our course covers. So it's actually a great sequence. So you click on that, and it brings up the box, and it forces you to go into that once. So we're just going to go into there uh, following the instructions. Okay, now it tells you to do uh, the mission warm-up. I'm just going to go ahead and close out of that. We'll come back to there. But what I want you to do um, is go back up to this Khan Academy thing in the top left here. This is how you get back to your home page, no matter where you are, no matter what you're doing. You click on that, and this is called your learning dashboard. This is your like home base. And what we're going to do right now is click on Coaches right here. And by clicking on Coaches, up comes um, Add a Coach. And in here, I'm going to type in our class code, which is right below this video. But it's 6AXZ3W. I'll click Join Class. And then off to the right here, you're going to see Brendan Delury as your coach. Uh, that allows me to see what you've done and also to recommend things to you, like what we're doing on class or what would be helpful coming up for a test. So already that's two of the steps there. Um, now, the next step you can get to in two ways. I like just clicking right here. There's nothing there right now because you haven't entered a name, but you could click right there. Or more directly, you could go to your student profile, and then it's bigger up top here. So let's just close this. And right here, I want you to change your name because otherwise what I see is your email address. Um, and sometimes that's your name. Other times it's not. So just so I can see who is who, Click here and just once um, type in your real name. Best would be last name first, comma, space, and then your first name with all capitals. Um, you don't need to enter anything else, but this real name is how you show up on my class roster. So instead of, you know, whatever creative names you have for your email address, it'll just show up as your name. Okay, you click save, um, and now you're done. So you can always click here to go to your home page. Um, and where I'd suggest you get started is by clicking on Start with Algebra 1. Right now we've got 0% mastered, 0 out of 181 skills. So you click on Start. And the first thing it does is takes you to a mission warm-up. So you'll click Get Started. And what this is is a pretest asking what you already know. Now, if you know these problems, for sure do them. Okay? If you want to know how to do them, click I'd Like a Hint or Watch a Video. However, it's just a pretest. If you don't know how to do the problem, just click I haven't learned this yet. And maybe all of this is new for me, so I'm going to click I haven't learned that one, or that one, or that one, or that one. Oh man, this is a really hard test. I didn't know how to do a single one. That's totally okay. What that tells the computer is, all right, we're going to recommend some of these easy skills for you later. Okay, And now you have two views of your class. Okay, You have this view which is where things will show up here. Um, when I recommend things for you as practice, it'll show up right here in a big capital orange letter. So it'll say recommended by Brendan Delury. Or if you're looking for a specific task, there's two ways you can find it. 
one you can type up here and just search you could say something like um gosh i really want to work on exponents um and it comes up with a variety you could type in a phrase you could do um, practices there's videos down here or if you want to navigate through algebra, up here on the right is view a full list of algebra content. So this is the place I would recommend coming because it'll give you mastery challenges and I'll explain those in class. And also it'll come up with recommendations that I give you. However, if you want to explore, click on view full list of algebra one content, always in the top right here. And it takes you to this other screen. Now this is where it lays it out section by section, kind of as a textbook does. So we started out with the introduction to algebra. That's really arithmetic. You see the minus, plus, times, and equals. So here it's, you know, expressions and variables. Uh, there's order of operations, how to deal with um, some exponents, combining like terms, um, expressions so down here, you know, translating sentences into words. Uh, yeah, and just basically the practice we've done so far in class will be in that first section. Um, what we're working on in chapter two here would be linear equations. And so that would be a great place to go. This is what we're working on in class right now. Okay, um, right here, solve equations in this form. Okay, one step equations, one step equations with addition and subtraction, that's section 2.1. Okay, two step equations, that's now section 2.2 and section 2.3. Okay, and so on and so forth. Okay, if you ever want to go back, you can just click on your little homepage, Khan Academy. And that takes you right back here. And you can go to start, and come back to this one. If you want to switch, top right switches the view to this other view. And again, top right would take you back to what they call your mission, which is again back here. Okay, I'll probably make uh, more videos in the future just to show you how to use the site, but I really wanted to get everybody to sign up, add me as a coach, and change your name. Okay, I hope this was helpful. This is my first time using this program. <laughs>